The House of Representatives Tuesday called on the federal government to put measures in place to stop the spread of anthrax in the country. Honorable Tanko Lokoja, the federal lawmaker representing Suleja Tafa Guarara, federal constituency of Niger State, noted that laboratory tests conducted on collected samples by the National Veterinary Research Institute confirmed the first reported case at a livestock farm located in Gayin village along the Abuja Expressway, Suleja, Niger State. The lawmaker says symptoms include sudden death and blood oozing from the natural body openings such as nose, ear, mouth and anal regions from affected livestock, bushmeat and contaminated environments could affect humans who come in contact with such animals. Worried that anthrax may affect humans in direct contact with affected animals and contaminated products with potential inhalation through spores or wounds, recognizes the urgent need for proactive measures to prevent the spread of anthrax in Nigeria and protect the health and livelihoods of citizens by placing public health precautions in places such as strict surveillance and monitoring of livestock farms as well as proper disposal of infected animals and contaminated materials. Acknowledges the effort of the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development and the Niger State Government in promptly addressing the issue by implementing necessary measures to contain the spread of anthrax and protect both livestock and human health. Resolves to urge the Federal Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development development to collaborate with relevant stakeholders in implementing effective surveillance, vaccination and awareness campaigns to contain the outbreak and provide adequate resources and support to affected communities, including compensation for losses incurred due to the outbreak. Two, urge the National Center for Disease Control to put in place measures that will stop the further spread of anthrax. Three, mandate the committees on agriculture product, agricultural production and services and legislative compliance when constituted to monitor the compliance. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.